I was reading an article the other day and it said it's okay to use emoji in business communication. Fascinating. And you know, it must be true because my inbox is littered with advertisements that use emoji. And likewise, you find emoji in LinkedIn titles, posts, everywhere. So why emoji? Well, in short, communication is more than just words. The statistics vary by study, but everyone agrees that a significant portion of communication is nonverbal. And that is where emoji enhance the conversation. They help convey the nonverbal. For example, in that email, what was your tone? Do we leave it to the reader to interpret? Or can we assist with well-placed emoji? And that is where emoji tie into people saw. On my screen is a national identifier masked using a generic character. Now this would communicate so much more if we used a picture, such as say a padlock or my favorite, the see no evil monkeys. But what about our code? People code is a Unicode language, which means we can instrument our code with emoji to help communicate meaning. Here, I have some examples. So on the screen, I have examples of funny code comments. So the first one there, for example, what emoji would you use with this first comment? What about the second one? So let's take a look at some people code. And I don't know, I'm just thinking, what emoji might I put here? Now, perhaps, have you ever had one of those moments where you're looking at some code and you've got, you know, the face palm moment where you say, oh, add some emoji comments. Maybe you've got a confused look. Maybe there's a confused emoji you might want to add to a comment. Or maybe a fierce face, but then, there may be some emoji that still aren't appropriate in a business setting. What do you think of using emoji in your code comments? Let us know in the comment section. At JSM Pros, we have a whole library of people tools tips to share with you. Check it out at jsmpros.com slash all access to get access to all of our recorded courses, videos, activity guides, and downloads, everything. And be sure to check out our live events as well. We teach people tools topics like this every week. Or here's an idea. Do you have a group you'd like to train? Give us a call and let's get something scheduled. Now, if you enjoyed this episode, be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe for more content. And we look forward to seeing you in the next episode.